I'm Raheem Nazarali. I'm one of the plastic surgeons at the Stanford Healthcare Group. I specialize in microsurgery and complex reconstruction, and so I work with a lot of the other surgeons at the hospital in helping take care of cancer and trauma patients. When a tumor is small, the colorectal surgeon is able to remove it in its very early stages with a very small resection. But when a tumor becomes larger and starts invading the other areas around the body, that's when a reconstructive surgeon needs to get involved with trying to repair those defects. After the cancer surgeon is done with removing the tumor, you end up having a space within that area that the tumor was occupying. And that has to be filled with something. We try and take tissue from another part of the body and move it into that space to help fill that space, to help prevent that gravitational dependent fall that happens inside the belly. The three main approaches that we use here are something called a VRAM, which involves one of the rows of the six-pack muscles along with the tissue on top of it. And we can turn that sort of inside out and bring that down to help cover the area. We may use the gracilis muscle from the inner thigh along with the tissue from the inner thigh and bring that into the area to help with some soft tissue bulk. Or we may use the tissue on top of the gluteus maximus muscle to try and bring that inwards and help eliminate the dead space that's created by the defect that's present from the cancer. In terms of complex reconstruction, a lot of the cases are based off of moving tissue from one part of the body to another part of the body. And that's generally based off of blood vessels because the tissue that you move has to have an appropriate blood supply. And so the goal is to move tissue based on a small blood vessel, it may be one to two millimeters big, and either we detach that and then reattach it to another part of the body and have that tissue live off of that blood supply, or we keep it attached and are able to move it from one area of the body to another area of the body. Many patients come in afterwards and they're very happy to have had the second opportunity. They have their confidence back, they have their life back, their time with their family back, and that's, that's what makes it really rewarding.